greetings. About, um, gosh, about a week ago now, I uh, planted these, maybe even a longer. This is all spinach. And uh, some of them did not grow, some of them did. Um, the spinach, maybe the seeds I was using were, the seeds I was using from this package were newer or fresher or more healthy. I got nothing out of my tomatoes. Um, but I did get, let's see, uh, nothing in, these were, this was, uh, uh, don't remember. But these are carrots. I can open this. And they're doing quite fine, <clears throat> relatively speaking, compared to the others, which I got nothing. Um, and my radish, I've only got a couple. I got the cage here to keep the squirrels out. I think the squirrels ate my cucumber and beans and squash. That's why I put the cage around it. All of this, I show all of this because in less than 48 hours, I've got germination on my broccoli. What I did was I put um, the broccoli seeds, tomato seeds, and what is that back there? <clears throat> Onion, and this is okra. I put the seeds between, um, or sandwiched between uh, paper towels and put some water on them and kept the light on <clears throat> for the last 24, 36 hours and I already have germination. So these will be much easier. I'll just use uh, tweezers and put those in soil and get them started. Now, I don't see the same activity in the others, at least not yet, although that tomato, it's hard to tell, I know the focus is probably not working, but that one there looks like it's about to uh, germinate. And those, that one there, it looks like it's about to germinate as well. So. I'll keep you posted, but this is a very apparently this is going to be a, quite the useful way to begin germinating seeds. Um, I've done it before in the past. <gasps> Look at those; the okra is already starting as well, and that looks like it's going to start in there too. Oh, look at that! So that's less than twelve. That's less than twenty-four, thirty-six hours, people. So this is a very useful technique uh, for starting your seeds for a garden. Thanks for watching.